Hello, this is James Bremner with version 1.03 of the module 2 software, which you can get from the release page of GitHub. And just download the zip and unzip it, and you end up with a folder that looks something like this. I get rid of the zip file, and you're just left with all the executables. First executable, of course, is module 2 itself, which starts up and waits for data to come in. There's nothing coming in right now because we don't have any simulators running. So let's start up the InData 1 simulator. Oh no, let's start up the, uh, the, the uh, module 3 simulator, which has a real-time plot of the output for module 2. Still nothing there because module 2 is not getting any input, so I'm going to start up the InData 1 simulator. Any moment now. There we go. Uh, so it's sending data to module 2, which is receiving it, processing it, and sending it out to module 3. Module 3 has a real-time plot of it, flicker free now, which shows 10 seconds of data updated as it arrives from module 2. Sawtooth simulator. And uh, here is the CPU display of the amount of CPU used. As we can see, it's about 60 70%. Still plenty left. Mm. 